up peeps welcome back to my channel so today's video is going to be a get ready with me for my birthday on this look i just really wanted to focus more on the skin and have it more simple this year nothing too crazy just because i did get eyelash extensions and these are mink lashes i will be doing a review of the place that i went maybe in the next couple of days so testing it out it's thursday i had it since monday but if you guys want to see how i got this look very simple it's mainly just about complexion and lips go ahead and keep watching this video i'm also throwing in my birthday outfit at the end so i hope you guys like it if you do give it a thumbs up subscribe to my channel and let's go ahead and jump onto the video and fill my eyebrows in with my brow pencil from elf in the shade natural brown Gonna go ahead and bring in my wet and wild kit eyebrow kit and i'm going to be taking both shades and lining the bottom of my brow as well as the top Alrighty, so my brows are finally on. I did set them with my NYX brown mascara in the shade um, Espresso. So I went ahead and already put that on my brows. So I'm going to go ahead and prep my skin. I'm going to be applying the Too Faced Hangover Replenishing Face Primer. And this, is ha um, this one has coconut water in it. I've been using this one. I like it because it moisturizes my skin. But because it's been hot lately, my skin is getting a little bit more oilier than um, the last past couple of months. So I'm going to go ahead and apply this all over to my face to help lock in that moisture and to prep my skin. The foundation I'm going to be using today is the Wet n Wild Photo Focus Foundation. The shade I have is in medium dark with a warm undertone and I'm applying it with my Real Techniques Beauty Sponge and... I've used this maybe two times in the past and I really like it just because it is kind of mattifying but it doesn't feel dry on the skin especially with the primer that I use and my whole skincare regimen which I did post a updated skincare routine which I will link down below but I'm going to go ahead and just apply this straight from the spatula to my face blend it I'm going to go ahead and use my Real Techniques sponge and just pounce this on my face and you kind of want to work fast because I noticed that this does set down fairly fast if you don't work it into your skin good so as you can tell it does dry down to a fairly matte finish so to conceal my under eyes I'm going to be using my LA Girl Pro Concealer in the shade Pure Beige just applying this under my eyes in a triangular motion I would suggest using a beauty blender or beauty sponge with this foundation just because after setting it, like I didn't set it with powder or anything, but after blending it into the skin, applying found a concealer, it kind of seems fairly thick on the top. So to kind of melt the product into your skin, use a sponge. So now that my face is concealed, I'm going to go ahead and set everything with my Wet n Wild contour and highlighting palette i'm going to take this banana shade and just set this under my eyes i'm not going to bake just because i can tell that it's already pretty thick and i don't want to kick it up anymore i'm just doing a light layer to set my foundation even though it is a matte finish i always like to set my foundations i'm using my milani um powder foundation with my elf round top brush and just set the remaining part of my face if you need extra coverage this would give you extra coverage just because this is a powder foundation to warm up my face I'm gonna go ahead with this shade right here and just with a light hand with my elf angle brush 
dip it in a little, not my elf, my wet and wild angle brush and just dip it in and warm up my forehead. The blush I'll be using is by Jordana. It's in the shade Terracotta and with a crown brush, just um, dip it in there, smile, and apply. Highlight my face, I'll be taking this Wet n Wild Highlighter in Precious Petals which look just like this. It's a champagne color. And I'm going to take it with my Morphe M438 brush, which is a tapered brush. Apply this to my cheekbones. My nose. There we go. So the lip liner I'll be using is from Jordana in the shade Coco Loco. So I'm going to simply fill them in a little bit. The shade I'll be using on top is from NYX in the liquid suede um, lipsticks in the shade Soft Spoken, which is like my everyday lip. Over top of the lip, I'm going to do a gloss, and I'm using NYX's um, lip gloss in the shade Miami Babe. To set everything and make sure it doesn't look powdery, I'm going to use my rose water again. get ready with me um i just wanted to do a simple look for my birthday if you guys did enjoy this video don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel we're almost at 1200 subscribers here on 808 cupcakes so if you want to join the cupcake fam go ahead and click subscribe click on the bell so you guys are notified of future videos from me also follow me all on my other social media they're always linked down below and until then i'll see you guys in my next one bye